Located in the heart of Europe, Germany today maintains the continent's most powerful economy. However, it is probably best known for its World War II history and the country's even more recent times when it was split into East and West. Everybody knows about the Berlin Wall, which came down less than 30 years ago. There's a load of culture, natural beauty, and much older history to discover in this large European nation. In this video, we explore the best places to visit in Germany. We've collected a list of the top places to visit in Germany, so make sure to include them in your list if you're a visitor. At first in the list, number one, Berlin, a federal state and the capital city of Germany. Berlin is widely associated with its World War II history and former division of East and West Germany by the Berlin Wall during the Cold War. Since the fall of the historic wall in 1989, Berlin has been a vast, unified city diverse in ethnic groups and abundant in sightseeing attractions, culture, accommodations, and nightlife. Many tourists are drawn to Berlin's famous historic structures, which include the Brandenburg Gate, Reichstag, and the Holocaust Memorial. Number 2. Munich Best known as the origin of the world-famous Oktoberfest, Munich is a major international hub for research and technology. The capital of Bavaria, Munich is Germany's most prosperous city, boasting research universities, global companies like BMW, and state-of-the-art science museums such as the Deutsches Museum. However, Munich is only part of business. This vibrant city offers one of Germany's best cultural scenes, presenting several sophisticated opera houses and theaters like the National Theater. Number 3. Fussen, set in a scenic spot at the foot of the Alps. Fussen is the last stop on the romantic road and can be found right in the south of Bavaria, just a kilometer from the Austrian border. While the enchanting town is well worth exploring, most people visit the three fairy tale castles that lie nearby. Although Hohenschwanger and Hohes Schloss look impressive with their prominent hilltop positions, arresting architecture, and imposing turrets and towers, the real showstopper is Neuschwanstein Castle. Number 4. Heidelberg. With historic treasures like the medieval old bridge, the Heidelberg Castle, the Church of the Holy Spirit, and the Knight St. George House, it is no wonder that Heidelberg is a popular tourist attraction. The city center's main street, Hauptstrasse, is packed with pubs, restaurants, open-air cafes, hotels, and shops selling the likes of beer steins, cuckoo clocks, and German sausages. Not far from the old town is Thingstadt, an outdoor amphitheater originally constructed by the Nazi regime to promote propaganda events. Number 5. Dresden. Before being severely damaged by World War II bombings, Dresden was known as the Jewel Box because of its lavish collection of stunning art and architecture. After many years, the city has restored much of its former glory. The capital of the federal state of Saxony, Dresden, is one of the largest urban districts in Germany, serving as an important center of government and culture. Dresden offers several interesting landmarks such as Brühl's Terrace's beautiful plaza and the Zwinger's magnificent palace complex. Number 6. Romantic Rhine. Stretching between Bingen and Bonn, Germany, the Middle Rhine flows through a dramatic geological formation called the Rhine Gorge. This region features a spectacular landscape with medieval castles, picturesque villages, and terraced vineyards. Tourism flourished here after aristocratic travelers brought much attention to the area during the Romanticism period of the 19th century, and the area became known as the Romantic Rhine. The inspiration behind poems, paintings, operas, and legends, the Romantic Rhine today is a major tourist destination in Germany. Number 7. Lübeck. As one of the largest Baltic seaports in Germany, Lübeck is located in the country's northernmost state. Schleswig-Holstein. Founded in 1143, Lübeck served for several centuries as the capital seat of the Hanseatic League. 
Although it was the first German city to be bombed and damaged during World War II, Lübeck retains much of its medieval architecture, making it a popular tourist destination. Dominated by seven Gothic churches, the city's old town presents an attractive setting of romantic medieval architecture intertwined with modern-day infrastructure. Number 8. Lake Constance, the third largest lake in Central Europe. Lake Constance is nestled in the foothills of the Alps, straddling the German, Austrian, and Swiss borders. It comprises three main parts with the Obersee or Upper Lake connected to the Untersee by Seerhain, a small section of the Rhine River. Long a popular place to go, Lake Constance is blessed with crystal clear waters, a mild and sunny climate, and lots of gorgeous scenery. This makes it ideal for swimming, sunbathing, and sailing. Number 9. Ruggen Island Favored for its remarkable landscapes and romantic seaside resorts, Ruggen Island has flourished as a popular tourist destination since the 18th century. Located in the Baltic Sea as part of the state of Mecklenburg-Western Pomerania, Ruggen Island is the largest island in Germany, connected to the mainland by the Ruggen Bridge and Ruggen Causeway. Charming villas, historic old towns, and beautiful beaches all draw tourists to Ruggen Island. Still, the star attraction is the Jasmine National Park, famous for its unique chalk cliffs rising 161 meters over the sea. At last in the list, number 10, Bamberg, widely considered one of Bavaria and Germany's most attractive towns. Bamberg is built over seven hills, with various canals and the Regnitz River running through it. It was once the seat of the Roman Catholic Archdiocese of Bamberg and, for a brief period, the center of the Holy Roman Empire, so wealth poured into its streets, with architectural marvels erected around town. As such, history and heritage can be found wherever you go. The narrow medieval streets of Altstadt are particularly enthralling to explore. Now it's time to hear from you what's your favorite places to visit in Germany. Is there something we missed? Let us know in the comments section below. And don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to Greenable if you haven't already clicked the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.